Hi, I'm Kennedy from EOS Singapore. Process monitoring is widely used across many industries for quality assurance and for increasing machine uptime and reliability. When combined with the emergent process monitoring tool, will eventually allow for in-depth process control of the powder bed fusion process, which is essential for wide-scale industrial credibility and adoption of this technology. Have you ever wondered what is happening when you produce part additively layer by layer in a powder bed system? Are you able to highlight any abnormality during the laser melting process? What you are seeing now is the EOS live recording of optical tomography or OT monitoring software. In an OT monitoring system, a CMOS-based camera that collects light emission in the near infra spectrum is used to yield one image per layer, which can be automatically analyzed for indication of quality issue. The purpose of the experiment is to correlate the defect detection between the OT signal and X-ray CT scans. Under normal operating conditions, the occurrence of defect causing instability may be quite rare and thus require a large number of print jobs. In order to overcome this challenge, processing stability is artificially generated by altering the inner gas flow at a specific region of the build platform. A poor inner gas flow condition can trigger smoke plume and sputtering effect. This in turn can then lead to defocusing of the laser beam. This can subsequently lead to improper melting on the powder jet and leads to defects. In this section, a short floor decision-making case study is shown for serial production using the coloration methods developed. Using the coloration established for this industrial shallow component, the exposure OT software allows a quick way for a quality assurance engineer to identify potential defects. This can be achieved using the extreme hotspot gray value flag up by the analysis software and checking for the overlap of hotspots. It is possible to perform qualification on a specific part of build jobs. The unique OT intensity profile can then be used as a reference for future printed parts on the same system. Using a control limit of plus minus 10% of the mean value as example, the engineer can monitor whether there is process deviation from the expected mean value in the different build jobs. Thank you for watching. Feel free to reach out to us for more in-depth sharing of the study and result that we have been carrying out.